Hi, my name is Judith Love Cohen. I've been an aerospace engineer for many years, and part of my story is being told in a new book called The Women of Apollo. When I worked on the Apollo system at TRW, which is now north of Grumman, we were doing the part called the abort guidance system. Now, we were part of the lunar excursion module, which actually landed on the moon. And one of the things that you may think about is if you're going to land on the Earth, you have air, so it can allow a glider to use wings, or you can use a parachute, or you have other things to help break your fall. But if there's no air, how do you do it? Well, what you have to do is have a rocket engine that burns, and it has to burn in the right direction and with the right amount of thrust. And so what you need is a guidance system to tell it what to do. My job was to work on the abort guidance system. This is an emergency or backup system. It's much simpler. It could be started by the astronauts if the main system failed. It turned out that the system was actually used two times. Now, it didn't help land on the moon. The two times it was used was to help the astronauts return back to Earth orbit so that they could land safely on the Earth. It was used in Apollo 12, and it was used in Apollo 13. Now, I know this because many years later, some of the astronauts told us that our system saved the lives of some of them. I'm very proud of this. Now, you can check us out at www.cascadepass.com and get the book.